Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and today we're going to do this glamorous over-the-top makeup look um, I'm going for a win tonight with the girls from RuPaul's Drag Race here in Copenhagen Some of them are going to come here and perform so that's fucking amazing um, But I wanted to do like the makeup I would wear tonight which is this one It's gonna last all night but I wanted to show you guys what I was doing, but I didn't realize I wanted to show you guys before I was halfway through. So I already had some of the makeup on and it was already halfway through. So we're going to start with the eyes today. So keep on watching. Okay guys, so as you can see, I already did my face. I already did foundation, setting powder, contour, blush. So let's just go into the eyes. So let's get started. But first, we're going in with our NYX Cosmetics HG Eyeshadow Base. And we're just going to put that on each eye. Just a bit. And then we're just going to blend it out the finger. Okay, we're starting off with using our M Decay Electric Palette. And we are going in with the color jilted to begin with and we're just taking our morphe mv23 which of course is a vegan brush because we don't use no animal hair on our faces and we're just going to set the pri the eyeshadow primer Then we're going in with the color Savage and we're just using that as a crease color and we're just gonna blend that out. It's such a pretty pink color but mixed together with it all it just, just looks stunning. And then we're going in with my favorite color, the color Urban, which is more of a dark, beautiful color. And we're going in with our ELF Cosmetics eyeshadow brush. And we're just gonna pack that on top. And then we're going in with our NYX Cosmetics brush in number 17, which also is just a fluffy, cute brush. And we're just gonna blend in that crease. And we're just buffing. When that is buffed out, we're going back in with our Morphe MV23. We're going into the urban color again, and we're just slowly building up the crease with a more intense purple color. And then we're going back in with our NYX brush and just blending. And we don't mind blending upwards. And if you do not want it as dramatic as I'm doing it, you can always put the crease lower down to make sure it is not as dramatic and huge. But because we, um, I am going to a drag show today, just as a viewer, it needs to be as dramatic as possible. Okay, now that is done, 
we're going in with our NYX Cosmetics brush number 15 and we're just gonna blend the inner corner so it's not, not as harsh perfect okay and then we're going in with our NYX slide on glide on eyeliner in 06 Esmeralda and we're just gonna put that on the below the waterline and on the waterline as well and now it's time for the elf professional eyeshadow brush and we're just going with the color trash from the mdk electric palette and we're just putting that on top of the eyeliner just to make the color more vibrant and more fresh. Perfect. And then we are just going in with our NYX Slide On Glide On Pencil in 07 Jet Black and we're just gonna color the lash line and we're just going to do that to make sure that when we put the lashes on the look will look more, the eyelashes will look more natural And now we're taking the Morphe MB11 brush and we're just going to smoke that black line out just a bit. And now it's time for NYX Cosmetics Glitter Primer. And we're just going to use that with our ELF Cosmetics Professional Lip Defining Brush. And we're just going to put that in the center of the eyelid just a bit just to make sure even though I know what we're going to put on next will stay we will just make sure it stays longer sorry guys just make sure it will last longer and then we're going in with our glitter tubes pressed glitter pants and we are going in with the color that's called Twilight, which is this beautiful, beautiful eyeshadow. And we're just going to pack that on with our Royal and Langnacle Concealer Brush in BMD 210. And we're just going to pack that on on the center of the lid. And then we're just taking the e.l.f. brush again on some of the NYX glitter glue and we're just tapping that in the inner corner. And then we're going back in with the glitter. And there we go. Even though it looks kind of blue, it isn't really blue, it's a purple glitter that had, had blue reflex in them, so it's kind of like magic. Okay, and now we're going in to curl our lashes, so we're taking our eyelash curler and we're just curling the lashes away. And then just before we put eyelash on, I'm just to make sure that the glitter stays, no matter what, we're gonna lock it with our Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. I'm just gonna tap that on top. Just so we are sure it stays on. We're gonna do that all the places that we have the glitter. And then it's time for mascara. We're going in with our NYX Stacked Mascara which is 
one of my favorite mascaras when it comes to wearing eyelashes because it just colors the lashes and separates them so nothing more so while letting the mascara dry we're just going in to make some eyebrows I'm starting off with going in with the NYX Slide On Glider Eyeliner in 12 Azor and we're just carving out the brow just to make a beginning and then, we go then it's time for the um, Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in Ultraviolet And now we're going in with our NYX Cosmetics Faux Black, Black Eyeliner in O2 Oxblood. And we're just carving out. Then we are using our Royal and Langnickel Brush Essentials in Angled Brow BBBE 210 and we're going in mixing the color Revolt and Gonzo in the Electric Palette just to get a tiny bit of glitter mixed with some blue. And then we're going in with the color Chaos. And then we're going back in with the color Urban. Just to finish it off. Voila, the brows are done. So let's put on some eyelashes, yes. We're going in with our Duff Lashes in Foaming and we're going in with the name Bambi. We're going with a smaller set of eyelashes today because we want to show off some glitter. So I'm quickly going to take them on off camera so if you want to see me put lashes on I will link the lash video down in the comment section. So go watch, go watch that one if you want to put on eyelashes. Now it's time for mascara on the lower lashes. So we're going in with an exact mascara again and just to color the lashes. So. Done. So let's go in with some magical highlighter. And for highlight today, we're going to use the Lime Crime Highlight Opals palette. And it looks like this. It's so stunning. And to highlight today, we're doing our, using our Royal and Land Nickel Highlight and Glow brush. And we're going in to begin with, we're going in with the pink one over here. And we're just dipping the brush in, dipping the highlighter on, and then we're just highlighting our face with this blinding highlighter and on the tip of the nose 
down the back of the nose and on the cupid's bow and let me just a bit down where the beard begins and then we're going in with the peach bun right there and we're just going in just above the brows And then we're going in with our Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And we're just mm. wonderful. Now the face is set. There we go. We are blinding for the gods. For lipstick, we're going in with our NYX Professional Makeup or NYX Cosmetics. Slide on, glide on, lip liner in number 19, Alluring. I'm just going to sharpen that. I'm going to do that with my favorite pencil sharpener of all time. It's the H&M Double Sharpener. It's so good. And it even sharpens my jumbo eye pencils, which I think it's hard to find a pencil sharpener that actually works for those because they're kind of big. Um, and it works for, yeah, everything. It's such a good pencil sharpener. But back to the lips. Now it's time for some the li real lipstick and we're going in with the Goss Cosmetics lipstick in number 19, Matte Angel, which is a pretty, pretty awesome pink nude lipstick. And voila, the lipstick is on. Mm, 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 mm. Yes. And just to go into something else, we're taking the e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set Spray. And we're just trying something else in the Urban Decay setting spray. Mm. It has a lot of power when it sprays. It's There's so much coming out of it. So I'm just quickly going off camera and doing my hair and then I will be right back for you girls and boys. So guys, that was it for today. So if you like this drag inspired, but not drag makeup, but just over the top glitter glamour, then please press the like button. And if you haven't already, subscribe because you know you want to. Now I'm going to get ready, clothes wise, for the drag show tonight. So, see you guys next time.